helping make your life easier. Moms Every Day with Cat Cooper. Feeding our families used to be so simple. Now there's so much information out there, much of it contradictory, and it's hard to know what to trust. Sometimes an expert can help separate fact from fiction. Here with more from Milk Means More is Dr. Jill Brester. Welcome. Thank you. Thanks for having me. Of course. Thanks for being here. Now, as a veterinarian, you work with dairy cows. Can mm -hmm. you help us understand what that they're what they're being given in their production facility might get into our milk? Okay. Well, the first thing that I want to say is that the milk we buy in the store is safe. Uh, it's all antibiotic free. That's one thing that people are always concerned about. Mm -hmm. um, I'm a mom of two young boys, and when they get sick, their doctor may prescribe an antibiotic. Mm -hmm. um, and that's pretty much the same when we talk about cows. So it would be inhumane to not treat an animal if they do become sick. Uh, but uh, when an animal is given antibiotics, especially a dairy cow, we are concerned about our end product. And so uh, that milk is discarded until she's healthy again. Uh, we have two primary goals. The first is keeping our animals healthy, mm -hmm. and the second is producing a quality product. And what about hormones? You hear a lot about hormones in milk. So another thing that you might see on the label is hormone-free. Well, what does that mean? Um, milk, uh, it contains naturally occurring mm -hmm. hormones. Um, most living things contain hormones. Yes. They're essential for life. Uh, but I can assure you that the naturally occurring hormones in milk do not pose a health concern. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. For more information on this and other wonderful topics for moms, log on to MomsEveryDay.com and have a great day. Helping make your life easier, Moms Every Day.